Hello, this is Kadeem. I'm going to show you how to get 240 FPS. Well, at least a very high FPS for your PC. I usually only get 130. But for our people who actually want to get more FPS, I'm going to show you how to do it. So, first thing first, you got to run. Misconfig. Uh, this is only for desktops. I mean, laptops it works the same thing, but it may have a little bit of problems uh, with this part. You go to boot, go to advanced options, go to number of processors, and put that shit on the highest amount. So I have eight processors, which I've never been using for some reason. I'm kind of stupid. But um, I'm going to put it on now. I put apply. And then it says restart your PC, just wait until afterwards. Number two, um, All right, go into go into PowerShell. Run as administrator, right? And then uh, go to the site. This is this is one one tool for everything, right? Copy this shit. Uh, and you you can actually look it up on Google. All you have to do is look up one tool for everything, and it just shows you it. And then you copy it, paste it here, press enter. And then go to tweaks. Uh, just put standard because honestly, like, you can do more stuff, but you know, just to be safe, uh, someone just told me to do standard before, so I think I just do standard. And it creates a restore point. And then press apply. It'll create a restore point, so just in case something happens, you can only just go back to it. And then press run. Now, if you actually want to put extra tweaks into there, um, there, there's ways you can do that, but like, I, I only mess around with the, the standard. That's all you really need is just standard. And then, uh, it should be done, actually. Is it done? Yeah, so you, you press act out. And uh, I didn't restart my PC yet, but like, um, I will. And then after that, you, you're pretty much done. You're pretty much done here. And then after that, you will see a major improvement in FPS. I can actually show you Fortnite and show you how much FPS I'm getting. I said I don't, I don't. I could probably play League and show you how much I'm getting because I know Fortnite will show you a big amount, but I'm gonna play League real quick. Uh, I, I I know it works for Fortnite as well. I have a GTX uh, 1050. I think a 1050 or a 1050 Ti. I don't remember which one it was. So I'm already getting like 144 FPS. Um, I didn't restart my PC when it comes to like the CPU thing. Because I can't really record at the restart on PC. But uh, once I use the eight cores, it'll be a little bit higher. So it should be at, at least 200 FPS without me restarting my PC. Remember, this, this is without restarting my PC. I think you're supposed to restart your PC afterwards. And then you should get like 240 FPS. Let me just sign in. Uh, the reason why you have to restart your PC because I, I upgraded the core that I didn't restart. I can't believe I wasn't using all the cores. I'm actually trolling. So this would be the this the game without the cores. 
without me with some NPC with, with the chorus. I have like eight chords, so honestly, it's going to be a major improvement once I restart my PC. Which I don't understand why I wasn't using it. Someone hacked me. I don't even know. Makes no fucking sense. I, I thought I always had eight chords. Like, can't believe I wasn't even using eight chords. And it was like the PC was like bugging out the whole time. Uh, you can also update your RAM too, but like, I, I'll show that another day. If you guys are interested, I, I'll show you how to do it. It's pretty easy to upgrade your RAM. Uh, if you if you actually want to upgrade your RAM, uh, you go to I, I have like 32 gigabytes of RAM, but if I actually wanted to use more RAM, I could if I wanted to. Now, I think this PC can actually go out to 32 gigabytes of RAM. We should see a major. Right, if it go, it should go up to like at least two hundred FPS. Uh, can you fucking load up? And it'll be at two hundred forty FPS once I uh, restart my PC. Which I will restart my PC. As you can see, I, I tested on my. I, I'm testing out on a laptop. Uh, I know the chords are actually like kind of weird, but I think it should work out pretty well now. All right, it's loading. You should see at least a dramatic difference, like at least like, at least like 200 or something FPS. You can also put it in a high priority mode. I'll probably get over that another time. And then graphic settings. Uh, I, I don't know what this is, but uh, I'm just gonna put uh, training uh, practice tutorial. Let's see. I'm, I I I know I I know it's gonna be more FPS, but it probably won't show it to me until I restart my PC. Remember, if, if you have problems. Or like something tries to stop you from like doing certain things. Uh, you can always just switch it back if you really want to. Just go to the same website and put one for everything. Uh, tool for one for everything in Google and you should be able to copy paste it. You all right, You can't type it in. You have to copy paste it. Just let you guys know that. Because I remember I tried to type it in and it didn't even work. Uh, once every time on PC I should have like a dramatic difference anyway. There's a lot more things you can do with that tweaking device, but I, I didn't have a tutorial on the website. I'm not really good at that kind of stuff. Like, I think you, I think you shouldn't mess around with that kind of stuff. It's like too much for you to deal with. It makes no fucking sense. I'm just waiting for it to load up. By the way, I, I think I think it's Vanguard safe. Let, let's see if it's Vanguard safe. So I'm, I'm I'm loading the game, so like if it's not Vanguard safe, it would like fucking kick me out. You know, you have to be careful about tweaks and stuff because you know Vanguard might do some dumb shit like bother you. But I, I think this is actually 100 percent Vanguard safe. Yeah, I remember I I'll get the virtual memory on the graphics card. Alright, well good enough FPS. That's the best FPS I, I gotten so far. So that's like 165. Usually I get 114. And once every summer VC I probably get more. So if you actually on a low end PC, this would be the greatest thing for you to do. To upgrade your PC, you also put the PowerShell on like high high performance. I can actually show you how to do that. You, you um, it's very it better in Fortnite, honestly. But um, 
I guess it gave me like a, a little bit of a boost. It gave me a little bit of a boost. Uh, I, I can show you where my graph settings are at. Uh, I have like 32 gigabytes of RAM. So, uh, you can see like I'm, I'm using like 16 gigabytes of RAM. Like 17, 17 uh, max in total. But like you're supposed to actually do double the amount uh, of the initial size. Depending on how much RAM you have. And I have 32 gigabytes of RAM so I'm actually trolling right now. I can actually up this pretty darn high. But I'm, I'm kind of stupid, so um, I, I I think about it. Um, I probably up it high when I get the chance because it was just making a lot of noise and stuff and bugging the fuck out. So like when I was doing certain Egyptian shit. So uh, yeah, if you want to upgrade the power supply, I, I think you can upgrade it to high performance. Um, if you go to like batteries. Battery settings. Uh, I think it's battery settings, right? Battery. Uh, I I rather not put it on high performance. I, I forgot what it was. It's like, oh, power options, right? Power options. Yeah, power power plan. And you can put this shit on uh, advanced, high performance. There you go. And you're straight. You can take off the turn on display every two seconds. Like sometimes I don't like that shit. Put put computer to sleep to thirty minutes. Ten minutes. Turn on display to ten minutes. Uh, I don't like that shit. You can turn off in thirty minutes. Yeah, and then make sure you put on high performance. Okay, good enough. And that's all. And I guarantee you, just by doing that, you will at least get 144 FPS or 240 FPS on Fortnite. Probably like 200 on like, um, inside the game. Um, it's completely Vanguard safe. I literally just went online and went 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 on League of Legends, pretty much fine, and it was actually working out pretty well. All right, and that's how you get uh, two hundred forty FPS in Fortnite. Uh, I had to reset my PC because I will go to power shot to eight 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 um CPU, so I probably will get more frames. So if you guys want to check it out, check it out when you get a chance. Thank you. Take care.